Hello, hello, and welcome back to stream. It has been a while. Let me get things all switched over here. Get sound volume back up. I'm gonna put my sound, uh, my music volume on the game at 45. I have no idea if that's good. Um, there'll be some trial and error, so please let me know if anything is too loud, too quiet. Just cause that's how these things work. Alrighty. We are finally back to stream, and we are here playing Toontown Corporate Clash. Um, for those who aren't familiar with Toontown Corporate Clash, um, it is a fan-made game based on the Toontown Online from like the old Disney website thing. You can still play that exact game, it's called Toontown Rewritten, um, but I like Corporate Clash a lot better. So we're starting off with our new tune. I've already gone through and created the tune, and I skipped the, um tutorial just because I wasn't live when I created the tune and wanted to not have to play through the tutorial and I already know how to play this game. So we're starting with Jinjuru, which is my um, tune in memoriam to my dog. So there's that. And we are starting off with the squirt and gag as uh, squirt gag and zap gag tracks. So zap is one of the ones that is new to Corporate Clash and I really enjoy the zap gag track and it relies on squirt so we're starting with those two. I think after that we might get... I'm trying to decide between sound and throw, but we'll see. We'll see what we do. So, I guess without further ado, let's dive in. Basically, um, the... Can I actually, can I talk to... Can I talk to Flippy? Is he gonna tell me anything if I go and talk to him? Basically, this game is about helping fight the evil cogs here in Toontown, um, to try and keep Toontown free. don't want to join a club right now. Can I talk to you, Puppy? Will you tell me anything? Okay, no, he, he won't tell me anything. That's fine. Okay. Cool, let's just dive in. So. Our first tune- our first tune task- goodness. It's been a long time since I've been on stream. It's gonna be an, an adventure today is going to, um, we're gonna visit Fran's Neckvine at the Punchline Gym and Punchline Place, Toontown Central. There are a whole bunch of side tasks we can do as well, um, but I think we'll do those... Wait, we should actually grab that one. Schoolhouse. Finishing Home, Lane, Libby Lane, Wacky Way. Toontown Central. We should grab that one too, okay. So we can have four tune tasks in total. So I'll grab three more. Let's grab yours. We'll choose that. So all the misery, here's his issue. He hates bugs, bugs of all kinds. Big bugs, with some bugs, especially ones you can't seem to get rid of. And everywhere in Toontown Central, there's butterflies everywhere. <laughs> can't stand it. So a bug suit the moth. Stumbled down the street. Ran into a cog. They stole his bug helmet. So now we have to get his bug suit back. Okay. Let's also go to you can also sprint in this game, which I don't know if you could do in the original Toontown. Hello! I am doing alright, you know? All things considered. This is the library, not the schoolhouse. I'm doing alright. How about yourself? not been in here in a while. Wow. Okay. Also doing good. That's good to hear. I'm gonna choose this tune task. Blah blah blah. I'm gonna, honestly gonna skip a lot of the dialogue in this game. Because it's kinda... I think there's a lot of fun dialogue, but it's, it's gonna be a lot to read. Because this is a pretty dialogue-heavy game, all things considered. <laughs> so... do. Oh. Wow, that's that's something right there. I'm not... Maybe you... This is a good idea. Hmm. 
I have played this, yes. This is um, a, one of my favorite games. I used to play Toontown online as a kid all the time. I didn't ever have a subscription or anything, but I played the free stuff. Um, and now I've played this. I have a tune that's pretty far along in this game. I need to go to Punchline Place. Um, but I'm starting off with a new one to play on stream, so. This is the tune that is um, in memoriam to my dog, so. Yeah, it's good times. There isn't any dialogue on the load screen, so don't- <laughs> It's gonna be some awkward silences and I apologize. But okay, that's where we're heading. Corporate Clash has this really nifty thing called a map. <laughs> I think actually Toontown Rewritten has it too, but the old Toontown Online did not have such maps. So we were just running around, oh geez, trying to figure things out. Do I actually have any gags on me? I do not. That's a problem. <laughs> we gotta go get some gags as soon as we get this task. Punchline Gym, there it is. This is a uh, corporate clash. Um, so, oops. this is Toontown Corporate Clash, which is the sort of like spin off game of Rewritten. I like Corporate Clash a lot more. There isn't an option on Twitch to stream to just the Corporate Clash channel, the channel category. It's all of it's Toontown Rewritten. I looked into it, and you just you just got to stream to the rewritten channel. Yeah, no, it's not TTR. This is TTCC. Um, so I, I personally like TTCC a little bit more. Um, and uh, Naf is my dog. We uh we had to put her down last Wednesday. Um, so I made a made a tune in memoriam to her. So it's the difference. Um, so Corporate Clash has sort of a different storyline, kind of thing. Um, it has a lot more developing features. Um. It's hard to explain. I'm trying to I'm trying to like differentiate because I haven't played Rewritten in so long. Rewritten is basically old Toontown, just like brought back. There's a few changes, like I mentioned the map on the street. I'm pretty sure that's in Rewritten as well these days. Um, but it's it's basically it's the old Toontown online just brought back. Um, Corporate Clash is sort of a like a spin-off developing thing. Um, I would highly recommend to, rep, uh, to try Clash out. If you liked uh, TTR, you'll love Corporate Clash. Um, it's some of my favorite features of this is new. There's this thing called groups built in to the game to find somebody to go th get things with. Like I could create a group right now. Oh, I can't do it because I'm too, um, I'm too, I'm too new. Um, one of the one of the fun things about restarting a uh, corporate clash is that there is a new gag track, the Zap gag track. It is reliant on the Squirt gag track, but I love the Zap gag track. There's also five suits of Cogs. Board bots are um, unique to corporate clash. They're a whole different suit um, with with a Cog disguise and everything for them. I don't think ooh, where's my Cog? Oh, no. I don't have the cog disguise button. I've been looking for it this whole time and just really confused because I don't have it yet. Um, so th this is the under construction BoardBot HQ still, you know, being built. Everything has sort of been renamed, and there's also a ye old Toontown section, which I, which I think is so much fun. Um, it's all been renamed that way. It's not like, it's not Disney esque, you know, because because they're a completely different story. So instead of it being Mickey's Toontown Central, it's just Toontown, or Minnie's Melody Land, Mezzo, the Berg, it's just the Berg still. Um, you know, Donald Dreamland, Drowsy, Don Donald's Dock, Barnacle Boat Yard, Acorn Acres, Daffodil Gardens instead of Daisy Gardens, and then, you know, the whole, all of that. I highly recommend this game. I have so much fun with this game. There's more tasks and storylines and all sorts of things. So there's a whole, also a whole bunch of side tasks for each playground and special events. I mean, I'm, you can't see them because I'm brand new to the game, so I would recommend it. It's absolutely free to play, always will be. Um, they have their own website. I don't know if they're like connected. They're not connected to TTR in any way, as opposed to being like, you know, we also do the same thing you know, kind of stuff. But I, I have so much fun with this game. It's also a much easier game to play because um, I don't know if you're familiar with the quest line of Lil Old Man. 
But there is no little old man. Boardbot, yes. That's the fifth um, cog suit that is unique to Corporate Clash. It's a whole new suit. They're building the HQ in the background. Um, it's it's great. It's, it's a whole bunch of bunch of board bots. They're fun. They add a fifth element, and there's something you know different to the unique war we had before. So yeah, I recommend it. And if you're unsure, I'm gonna be playing a lot of Corporate Clash on stream because I caught the Corporate Clash bug again. Um, so if you ever want to see some gameplay, just feel free to hop on into stream. I should be playing it a bunch on stream. So, because I kind of can only play one game obsessively at a time. It's the autism bestie. Um, I have two. <laughs> I have two jelly beans. Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna go on the trolley. <laughs> I haven't restarted in so long. I forgot how this stuff worked. And of course, I didn't do the tutorial because I'm like, I don't need to do that. Here we are. No jelly beans. So the way um, you earn, so you, in this, in the Toontown franchise, um, for beyond uh, everyone here, you fight the cogs by using gags. The way that you buy gags is with jelly beans, which is the con currency of Toontown, and you can either get those, I do not want to play, um, dance. No, no, no. Um, the way you can get jelly beans is by playing trolley games, completing tune tasks, all sorts of things. I don't want to play tug of war either. Oh my goodness. Give me something fun here. Catching game. Let's play that. I'll play the catching game. Come on now. Give me some, give me some apples. And trolley games are, oh, <laughs> I was talking, I wasn't paying attention. Trolley games are a little, you know, fun games that earn you some jelly beans. There are some easy and hard ones. My personal favorites are the ring game, the swimming ring game, and the cannon game. Those are my two favorite, um... You can skip games. Yes, you can. It is a... I don't know if TTR has that feature, but it is a rewritten... Oh my goodness, not rewritten. It's a corporate clash feature, and I... Love it. Because there is a quest. I just actually finished this quest. Um, when you're in the Daffodil Gardens quest line, where you have to go to all the playgrounds and play the catching game. Could you imagine having to sit through... I got the perfect score. Woo! Could you imagine having to sit through all those games trying to get to the stupid catching game without a skip button? Oh, it is truly a lifesaver. I can get... Oh, I can get ten of each. Yes, please. What else we got? Uh, I do like Toon Slingshot, but I think I'm gonna skip it. As much as I love it, I'm gonna skip it. No, Cog Thief is the worst. I can't play. Can't play. Ring top, ring game, yes! Oh, I used to sit here on my free-to-play Toontown, um, save, you know, because I didn't have a subscription when I was a kid, and just, like, play to, uh, trolley games over and over, and I would always get so good at the ring game. Also, the music is great. I totally get it. I totally get it. But, I mean, if you're thinking about it, I would give, um, Corporate Clash a chance. Like I said, if you're still unsure about it, once I earn some, um, jelly beans here, I'm gonna go out and start doing some stuff, rather than just running around Toontown Central. <laughs> so... It has all the nostalgia, but with some quality of life updates is kind of how I how I feel about it. Cool. All right. That's plenty of money. Let's go beat up some cogs. All right. So I need to for Mr. What's his head. I need to recover some exercise supplies from the cogs, and these are two of my side quests. Five bug suit parts and ten cogs in Toontown Central. So, let's go... I guess we'll go to Wacky Way. Why not? We're here. I can show off my zap gags. Ooh, I love zap gags. They're so much fun. 
Level three. I don't know if I can take on a level three and four right now. Where's my level twos? Hello. Okay, here's... Oh, yeah. There's a um, duck shuffler, which is a manager. I don't... There's, there's a manager for every street, playground. I don't know. I haven't really played much... Um, I haven't really played much manager content. I was kind of absent for that update. It's it's one of the cogs. I don't I don't really know. Like I said, I'm not super familiar with the manager bottom feeder. Um, manager update. Some of the cogs have gotten um, update updated looks. They're working on updated looks for all the cogs from the classic games, and then they're also working on a. Um, mix and match um, thing for tunes, so. Okay, so you'll notice that I used a squirt gag, so he has two rounds of soak. Um, soak cogs have minus 10% dodge chance and are vulnerable to zap gags. So zap gags um, will always hit if a cog has been hit by a squirt gag before. So, let me show off my, my zap gag. <laughs> And zap gags are pretty powerful. I did fight a level 2. I probably could have fought a level 1. That would have been easier in this situation. But you know what? Here we are. Exactly 3 damage. Perfect. And that is basically what we're going to be doing for the rest of the game is fighting cogs. All right, let's find... Oh gosh, get out of the way, get out of the way. Here's a level one. This will be easier. This is our a board bot. This is the base level board bot. They fly? That's a new... I've not seen that animation. That manager was getting real close. I was getting nervous. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, buddy, what you doing? Why are you so close? Lord Loud and Clear is talking to me. I'm just ignoring all those tune tips. I don't I don't especially need them. Alrighty, that's two. I did not recover a part from that one. Oh, here's a flunky. Good old good old flunkies. There we go. See if we get any bug parts. You can also skip through this screen as well, but I'm watching my tune tasks, so I will let it play out. A little low on laugh. You can, um, the doors that don't lead to any building will tell you jokes, and you can gain a little bit of laugh from each one. Joke. Oh, it's, it's, it's the same door. It's the same door. I forgot. There's a door. Alrighty, we're all full again. Oh, there's another bug. Peter? Okay. The old rigmarole roll here. Hooray! 
Hooray! Five, four, ten, okay. And um, there is spots in each of the um, streets where there is, it's gag and go. You can buy gags on the street. So you don't ever have to run back to the um, playground after you cleared your gags out because you fought a cog that was a little too high level for you. We've all been there. We've all been there. Oh, it's a cold level four. I was like, it's a cold collar. See, the cold collar is still the classic. He hasn't gotten the update um, yet. So. The double talker? Or the... Oops, sorry. My move on is very, um, dramatic. I'm so sorry about that. I need to figure something out. It also doesn't like emotes, apparently. I don't know why. I've tried to lower the settings, and it just still is extremely dramatic. settings some more real quick. Let me get on to the sidewalk here. Try to pull up Twitch. So this won't, you know, crash the stream because I'm trying to pull up another web page, but alas. Let me go into Raider Dashboard. Okay, yes. Stay manager, please. See if hopefully that um hopefully that makes it a little bit better. Maybe that'll let us have emo emotes again. Um, there should be an emote one on here. That's what the internet says, but there's not. So I don't know. Okay, back to it. That's my washer singing. If you can hear it, <laughs> sorry. A, either almost completely or completely different soundtrack from TTR. It's all been redone just for Corporate Clash. The people behind Corporate Clash, they put so much work into this game, which is just crazy. Oh no. Okay. Keep walking. Oh great. I'm gonna die. trying to join me. I'm just gonna leave. Because... Oh, there they go. Okay. Yeah, this is not good for me. Um... So... <laughs> Now we get to see what manager content is. Um, 
because I've never really never really seen that before. Moobot does suck. I'm so sorry. I've tried to lower the moderation settings. I lowered them a little bit more. So hopefully Moobot can chill out a bit. If that guy hits me, I am gonna die. So we get to see what happens when you get hit too much and do down. Haha. -ha. There we go, that'll hit everybody. Um, soaking, it jumps cog. So. these people have a tune-up because this is a bad deal. I'm a little worried what happens if he uh, gets... This is my last... This is my last gag. My last squirt gag. going to end well for me. So we just get to sit back and watch the fun, I guess. <laughs> oh, I didn't lock, sorry. That was my bad. Oh, you can make gag tutorials, okay. Oh, he's leveled up. Okay. What's he doing? He said watch. Hello! We are playing some Corporate Clash today. Sorry, what was I looking at? Oh, yeah. Levels. Where, where can I find that? Oh, yeah. Here we go. 
um, after every four levels, you can, um, get a new gag, uh, get a point when you need two points to unlock a gag track. So, okay, now that we got that all settled, um, that was interesting to say the least. Let's, um, are we on punchline place? No, let's head back to the playground then. All right, here we are. At least I didn't, you know, I just didn't die. There were the people here to <laughs> help me out. <laughs> oh, that was fun. Okay. All righty. Let's head to Punchline Gym. Okay, let's head back to the playground. I need to get some more gags. Go give those side tasks the whole nine yards. Alrighty. Okay, we need to go to AT Tester over here. Bug eyes, funkies. Okay, beat like what? Four funkies? Five funkies, okay. Let's go over to the schoolhouse. Wait, wrong side. They've changed <laughs> they changed where everything was um, from TTR, so I don't know where everything is as well in this game. Especially not in Toontown Central, because it's been a while since I've run around here, so... What do we need? Two heavy cog gears. Okay, that's easy. The broken something used to be... Something electricity, something use it actually set up smells like cabbage, tastes like cornflakes, zap gags. Okay. Oh man. Oh, I love these games. They're so great. Alright, let's head to Silly Street, I guess. Alrighty. Saw that cold collar level one. Aha! Let's, oh, it's a cold collar level two. I'll grab the level two. It'll take me a bit longer, but I'll grab it. Do one of these. I love TTCC. Um, this is this is not my first time playing. I have a couple of other tunes that I'm in my main tune. I'm working through. I'm almost done with the Daffodil Gardens quest line, um, so I've it, I've taken a large break in between my playing. But I thought I'd start a new tune, play it on stream because I love Corporate Clash. It's so much fun. You just missed it, but um, I had I got somehow in the middle of a manager fight. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing there, 
but I got in the middle of it. It was a whole, it was a whole deal. And I was like sitting there out of gags. And I'm like, guys, I'm out of gags. I'm sorry. They're like, you're good. <laughs> like, I'm sorry. I wasn't expecting me hitting this, you know, level one flunky. Hello. Hello. There we go. Just <laughs> turn into the manager fight. So that was fun. That was enjoyable to watch. So. This music is so catchy. I love it so much. any boss uh any flunkies running around here because i do need those flunkies hello it's like a con artist street yeah that's fine okay that's fine i'm just gonna jump over There were flunkies on punchline place. I'm missing one. Oh, come on. There we go. Any pinchers? Oh, it's a 5% boss bot. Mm. I'll run it real quick just to see if any flunkies hiding, but I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. I guess I could use the COG radar. Whoop, whoop, pressing buttons on my, my computer. Calm down. Okay. Can I do that yet? Oops. Oh, I can't. I don't know. I haven't found enough of them yet. Darn. Okay. That's fine. Change. Ah, oh, there's a flunky. Oh, it's level four. You know what? We're not gonna do that. I am uh, not quite. Oh my goodness. Pressing buttons. Not quite. Um ready for a level 4 flunky. Okay, yeah, let's jump back to the playground. <laughs> um, let's try the next one over. <laughs> oh, goodness. Into Wacky Way, let's head down this street. Was I just on some street? I don't know. Too many streets. Too many. It's a beer. Okay, it's a log on. Twenty percent, not bad. Run the street real quick. Okay. Bottom feeder. There's a flunky. Hello. Oh, we got both of those. Amazing. It's 
Gotta feed, feed five more flunkies. Four more flunkies. Whenever I don't see cogs on the street, I get a little nervous. Because back in the old days, when it was testing, you would go onto a street and there would be no no cogs. And you were like, ah, oh, great. And two seconds later, the game would crash. Good times. <laughs> Whenever that happens, I'm like, oh no. Because it glitched again. Monkey number two. All right, any more flunkies around? Pretty close to getting my second sport gag. Correct. Ah, oh, there's a level two. Hello, thank you. House of Bad Pies. Oh, that's always a, such a great shop name. House of Bad Pies. Sorry, we're open. It's one of the ones I remember from the old the old game. There are a couple of them that have always stuck with me. That one and um, the Yo-Ho Stop and Go from the from Donald's Dock, which is, you know, Barnacle Boat, Boat Yard here, but good times, good times. We are getting pretty close. Two more flunkies. All right. Ooh. Came out of nowhere. Dang. Another flunky. Ha ha! Excuse me. I'm going too fast. Because I can't, can't get him. All right. Perfect, we need one more flunky. That's all we need. Come on, flunky. I'm probably gonna have to run all over Toontown to find one. These streets are so empty. I am not used to how empty these streets are. So over in Daffodil Gardens, they're bursting at the seams, it seems like. Hehe. <laughs> Puns. It wasn't a pun, it was just me using the same word twice. Some flunkies. Any more flunkies? Please? We'll just go back and try another street. Let's try Luby Lane. Yes, man. Well, we're starting off with a boss spot, so that's good. 30%. Pretty good. Flunky, please. <gasps> See one, micromanager. Flunky, over there. Hooray. Alrighty.
All right, that is all five. Excellent. And we are three points away from getting a new gag. Very exciting. All right. Let's head to the schoolhouse, which is over here. No, other side. I'll get there one of these days. straps from cogs. Okay. There's a whole bunch of like Easter eggs in these books. Oodles of doodles right there. Oh. I want doodles. How to survive a doodle apocalypse. Aha. Uh -huh. Amazing. Ten cogs. All right, let's put a punchline place. See what he wants from us. Oh, I should grab gags while I'm here. came from the outside. We're just gonna pretend like we didn't hear that and keep playing Toontown. Mm-hmm. Nothing, like, near me to worry about. Just, you know, sounds. <laughs> well, now there's flunkies galore. Of course there are. run so fast. <laughs> Just ran into that one. Ah! Ooh. Going too fast. Tune headquarters. Okay. site right there. Classic, classic headquarters. Nostalgia galore. Mata Harry. All right. I've earned a training point. Effectively, cause not to take a joke. Help get classes back in order. Okay. So if we go to our gags and training, we have one training point. Um, we can put it to one of the tracks. I'm trying to decide which track I want. I think I might get throw just to have a solid
Obviously, having both lure and sound is kind of not useless, but like counterintuitive, especially when fighting alone. Um, I might get throw and then drop. Drop's always fun. So I'm gonna put it towards drop. Oh, I need... Oh, I can't just put one towards it. Okay, I have to wait till I level up. Let's get the second one. Okay, cool. So we'll put it towards throw. That way, I don't know, there's just something about the classic throw and squirt duo that we just gotta have. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's, uh, it's just... Okay, so let's... Head down to Silly Street. Before I do that, I think I'm gonna take a quick break. So I'm gonna go stand in the middle of this gazebo and put it to my break screen. I'll leave you with the sounds of Toontown. And I will be back in a few moments. Alrighty, we are back. Let's head to Silly Street. There it is. Just to make sure, yes, okay. Just had to double check that I wasn't unmuted. That I was unmuted, yeah. So we're heading all the way down there. Luckily, this road has a shortcut. Just gotta get to it first. I believe that's a shortcut right there. That's stuck again. Okay. Here we go. Instead of going all the way down and around, I can just go right through here. And then just head right this way. And a laugh properly. gas. And we're laughing gas. Cool. Alright. Let's go beat up some cogs. What are we dealing with? Cold collar? Yeah, we'll grab this cold collar. Oh, you're joining the party, are you? No? Okay. No, he's not. Okay. Didn't think that anything outside of managers could join the party, but...
two more. It's only uh, six more for the other one. Don't need a level three executive. Very nice. Yes! New sport gag. Very exciting. And if we go over here, I head to the gag and go. Glass of water. Damage is six as opposed to four. that my sword gag was only worth three. Damage four, damage six. Okay. Currently I can't read, so. Five of those, 10 of those, two more of those. All right, perfect. Let's see if we can get some other cogs here and get Zapgag to level 2 as well. Level ones, okay. Short change, it's smaller. It's smaller in corporate class than the average size. I love that. Ah, oh, so good. Oh, so fun. Okay, three more. Three more. Two more. We're almost there. So close.
we'll need one more. There's a level two. Let's grab that level two. Alrighty, that's the last one. <laughs> New zap gag! Light bulb! The gag and go. It's this way. Okay. Five of each. Alrighty, so now we only need three more gags for this one. Okay. Um, are we on Silly Street right now still? We are. Cool. I'm gonna run back to that store in case they want to give us another cog fighting task. So. Laughing gas. Jesse. Jesse's joke repair. Alrighty. Where's that one at? actually been faster to go around, but I'm using the shortcut. I like the shortcut. <laughs> Defeat some cogs. Okay. I'm just from some cogs. Okay. Cool, cool. A level two, a connoisseur. Oh, you missed it, rude. How dare you? I missed it too, then. Back at you, buddy. about them apples. And I missed that too. Ha. Just throw a light bulb at him. I love that. It's so funny. Grab two more while we're here. Grab this penny pincher. I've always loved penny pinchers. I don't know why, but I've always thought they were great. Missed. Haha. -ha. the idea of just carrying around five light bulbs just to throw at people. <laughs> Not people. Cocks. Alright, one more. We can definitely grab that. So level three. Oh, how about we do that? That's fun. My first level three. 20. Okay, that's not bad at all. Let's 
six, fourteen. I think that's exactly what I need. Missed it too. Ooh, beautiful. Yep, fourteen. Beautiful. Alrighty, let's head back to the playground. Actually, no, we need to go and stay on Silly Street here. We're going back to Jesse's Joke Repair. Okay. Punchline, you are the tools. Till next time. I go back to- yep. Yeah, I definitely think it was faster to go this way. Oh well. Live and learn. <laughs> Loud and clear. Yep, okay. Back to playground I go. Alright, while we're here, we need to stop by Baby Tester and Professor Pete. Okay. He's right over here. Send you an outfit in the mail. You can also access it from here. This is the outfit we've unlocked if we want to wear it. Also, it's the shorts option. But I think I'm going to stay with my blue and red. Just for right now. I guess I could do that. Oh, actually, I kind of like that. I think we'll do that. Keep my red shirt on for a little while longer. Alright, now we'll head over to the schoolhouse. I'm ironically running over here, buddy. I'm not gonna do whatever that is in the basement. Level five, I can now carry 500 je additional jelly beans, okay. I've now earned a teleport access to Toontown Central. Not from getting level five, but from completing this task. So now, um, no matter where I am in the world, I can go to Toontown Central if I'm you know, all the way over in if I'm over the, well, the, all the way over in the construction, I can teleport right here. But if I'm all the way over here, I can go right back. So. Big ol' meanie. Pockets full of... Ham? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I love that. That's funny. Can't do anything with that yet. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Pockets full of ham? Oh, amazing. Alrighty, so let's head to... Actually, what are some other side tasks we should do? Cat outfit. Invisible cheesy effect. We should do all of these um, eventually because they give us extra... Um, experience, jelly beans, all that good stuff. So, here's this one. Fish up a PB&J fish. There's also one with... That one? Is that the tourist? Yes. Tumbles the tacky tourist. I need to go talk to the person in the library. Mm 
Indian Jew fish travel guide. Okay. Let's go do some fishing. And show off the fishing mini game. Ooh. Fishing is quite fun in this game. It can also be irritating, but that's par for the course with fishing mini games. So. To one of these little docks here. Click and drag down from the cast button. The further down you drag, the stronger your cast will be. Adjust your angle to hit the fish targets. Pull down and the fish move. Um, that was not great. Dr. White, telephone, Dr. White. Okay, that's quite the one to start off with. I also spent a long time fishing in old Zoontown. Free to play, you know, doing the free to play stuff. Close enough. Aha, I got a PB and J fish. Cool. Let's go take that back over to the trash cat. Excuse me. I have a PB and J fish. Dr. White, telephone. Okay, we'll try that again. Interesting. Maybe it has to be not the first one I find. That was a bad spot. It does cost jellyfish to, um, fish. Jelly beans. Oh, okay, I had to catch the package and not the fish. Okay. Um, it costs jelly beans to fish, but you can sell your fish for jelly beans, so. It's a pretty good way to make jelly beans if you're bored. <laughs> and if you get it good, so. Sneezy Kitty. Silly Street. Let's go talk to Meta Harry while we're here, too. Bumpy Bumble Bear. Oh, he's right over there. Okay. Saw Loopy Lane. Yep, this is Sticky Lou and Loopy Lane. All right. Let's head to Silly Street first. Heading to building number two right there. It's yellow because it's a side task, as opposed to red for the main line. Quests. Oh! That was too close. Okay. Weird Beards Disguise Shop. Excellent title. Swindler. Cover a beard supply from a swindler. Okay. Yeah, not a lava. Well darn, that's okay. Any swindlers around at the moment? Soup Forks, also a classic title.
Any swindlers? See if there's swindlers down at the other end of the street. Aha, there's a swindler. I thought I saw one running in, so. I knew there had to be one. Oh, buddy, that's just rude. That was my last cup as well. That's fine. Get you with a sporting flower. Not dead yet. Okay, that should finish him out as long as it doesn't dodge it. There we go. We got it. Awesome. Don't worry about any more swindlers. Alright. Oops. It's right there. Back here, give this to the tourist one, and then we'll head to Loopy Lane. Oh, it was for Travis. Oh, okay. That was a disguise for the tourist. I don't know. This is what happens when I don't read the dialogue, but there's just a lot of dialogue in this game, like I said, so. For five level two gags. Here. Took all my glasses of water. <sighs> Let's go talk to Flippy. Oh, I never noticed Flippy's up there. Oh, that's fun. I'm gonna grab five more glasses of water first. Not even the first person to put in a good word for him today.
that seems to green people? I don't know what that means. Just, just covered by the fence. <laughs> okay. Sticky Lou. It's behind me. Aha! I was looking for it. It's behind me. Good. Plenty of blah bots here as well. Oh, and these are to start side quests. I think I have two available. Yes. The other one is down the way a bit. I thought there was one in that building there. Maybe I haven't unlocked it yet. Fun hat. Yeah, fit teach a little for firecrackers. Okay, igniters. Cogs from. All right, what do we need? Lawbots. Let's go fight some lawbots. Actually, before that, let's go talk to um. Sticky Lou. Just in case. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. That was almost bad. I was almost stuck. Okay. That way in case um, Sticky Lou wants us to fight some Lawbots. The Merry Mimes on Silly Street. Okay. Don't want us to fight Lobots. That's fine. Hey, you. Come here. I'm gonna, gonna fight you. Perfectly. Alrighty. Cool. Oh, I was gonna get that one. It wasn't fast enough. Ooh, level four. Ooh. Maybe there's some level threes running around. Level one. Petty Fogger, level three. I knew he was gonna miss. I could just tell. Ah. It's fine. I'm using level two gags on a level three, so. Sticky. 
I don't think he has enough to take away all ten of my last, but... Oh, I missed it anyway. Perfect. No reason to worry. Fun, fun. Yeah, four points each. Oh, I didn't get Dude, those two. Oh. Pity. Okay, let's find some doors. Back up. And the door here. Oh, I walked away before it was finished. Oh, listen to it again. A door here. Oh nope. There's there. There's a door there. Okay. Alrighty. Full on left. Full on gags. Let's find some law bots. There's one. Easy peasy. Mm. A few. Grab this level three here, just for fun. I've also always loved this storefront because this is a reference um, to Oswald the Lucky Rabbit, um, who uh, is my favorite uh, Disney character of all time. So, always love Trolley Troubles. I used to have maybe we still have a tune in TTR. That is, it's a rabbit in there, Oswald. So, I should should load up TTR see if I still have that one. go inside, I don't know if there's any references. I mean, there should be, but... Oh no, there's just a... Just the sign. Well, there should be a rabbit in there, whose name is Oswald. That would be cool, but... That is also referencing, you know, Disney, which I don't understand. I don't know if, um... Corporate Clash can do that because of... Copyright laws and nonsense, you know what I mean? Ugh. Nose. Pretty bonker. Let's grab this one. The easy ones. <laughs> I 
Missed. Haha. -ha. Can I go fast enough for that bloodsucker? I don't think I can. Oh, I was. Haha. -ha. Buddy! Oh, come on! Rude! You know, there is a low chance that these hit by themselves. I'm just gonna see. Aw. Uh, okay, that's fine. There we go. Okay. This will take care of him now. I missed that. Beautiful. Alright, what do we do? How are we doing on Tune Tasks? Done, done, done. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Playground. Loopy lane, loopy lane. I'm on loopy lane. Haha. -ha. I think. <laughs> Metal casings. Okay. Now we take this into the two list. Ride the trolley for me. Okay, then we'll go fish up some bags of salt. game. Oh, one of my favorites. I'm bad at it, but it's so much fun. I think I went too far up. Yep, okay. Shot it just a little bit. Okay, close. 
Like I said, I'm bad at it, but I do love it so much. Uh, not quite. That might make it. Yeah! So fun. Let's play one more game while we're- oh. While we're here. Mmm, Jungle Vines is fun. I used to be really- Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh. There we go. That wasn't good. I was like- Glitched out of the vine. Oh dear. Hmm. Uh, we're just gonna sit here and let the timer run out. Um, and we're gonna, we're gonna, we're just gonna talk a little bit, I guess. Well, yeah, we'll just we'll just sit here and swing, I guess. You know, these things happen. Um, oh, am I synced up to the vine? No, okay. <laughs> we'll just vibe. I'm in a good vibe session here. Can I catch that banana? Oh, no, I'm just a little too far. That's okay. Yay! Alright, let's try that one more time. No, we're not playing the match game. Hmm. No. Uh, uh, we'll be fine. We can play more trolley games later. Yes! Excellent game! Truly pro gamer mode activated! <sighs> what was I doing? Oh, yeah, talking to tumbles. They said they would show up in other places around town. I wonder if they show up in later playgrounds. Hmm. All right, let's do some fishing. Bag of salt, that's one. Two. to make sure I'm going to try and catch another fish. Profile background aquarium. Okay. Clownfish. Okay. Let's try to do the fish bingo. Why not? While we're here. Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to click on him. Oops. getting starfish. I caught ten jelly beans. Okay. Sad clownfish. Uh, 
Chunkfish. Too far. An old boot! I like old boots. You can get anything of those. I think I have to get three bingos, because this is the three-way. I'm just vibing with this. I know this is not, like, riveting content, but I am vibing with Fish Bingo, man. Only have 49 seconds left on Fish Bingo. time and I've been unlucky with my casts. Also almost at a fishing room. I had to get it three way. Oh, I would have had a bingo there though. Okay. Didn't win bingo, but I can sell my uh, fish for jelly beans. Not bad. Alrighty. <laughs> now let's go back to, uh, actually doing stuff. Okay. Let's go to Silly Street and fight some cogs. Did I lose my gag? Oh, I'm all good. Okay. Sewer level three. Okay, I guess we grab that one. Which is like a glass of defeat. <laughs> Having a glass of water, actually. Executive. I don't. It's thirty. It's kind of a lot. Grab this cold collar. Why not? I didn't collect a thing from that guy. Oh. Rude. Hmm. See, now it's damage seven. I'm confused. 
Is it because I'm near a hydrant? I don't know. from that guy either oh, it's just me get a little bit more laugh before I jump into this next one that was a name dropper back there name droppers are fun Name Droppers used to be my favorite COG um, back when I played Toontown Online because it was the only um, base level COG with like a feminine frame. Obviously, I grew up AFAB. So, um, classic Toontown. There's different ones because there's, there's a few more board bots that have feminine frames. But classic um, Toontown had number crunchers, name droppers, and micromanagers all having like a feminine esque. Those were, of course, my favorites because. So, I'm almost out of laugh. Got one of each left. I need to find some doors. There's a door. Door. No, that's a shop, not a door. Need doors that go nowhere. Get this guy real quick. anything from that? Yes! Nice. I only need two more. It's definitely doable. Let's grab a little bit more laugh. Cogs, not anything specific, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll grab this cold collar then. I think that's the last of my level twos, yes. So I'll go grab some more gags from the gag and go. starting to come up on two hours of stream. I think I'm probably going to end it at about two hours um, just so I can ease back into three hour streaming after my extended break from the holidays and then everything else that happened. <laughs> so. Four or five. Alrighty. There's one more. Oh, I gotta grab the gags. Okay.
Is that the last metal casing we need? No? Okay, one more. The battle music is truly such a bop. You join the party? Oh, it's getting a little close. I was like, hi there. Gonna join the party? You join the party? Oh no, okay. Is this our last metal casing we need? There we go. Alrighty. So let's... Oh. I'm right in front of it. Amazing. Did this on purpose. Absolutely. Yeah. 100%. Hello, Silent Simone. Fair enough. So now I'm gonna go, um, back to Sticky Lou. Oh, everyone's on Loopy Lane. This is so good. I'm not on Loopy Lane. I'm on Silly Street. Okay. When we, um, were playing earlier, that cat was- I saw them spawn in as Colorful Cat, um, which is the stock name that they give you, like, my character was Colorful Dog before my name was approved, and now Wonder Munchkin is on their way. Or maybe not. Well, there was a Colorful Cat that looked exactly like that with that shirt and pants. Um, so... Don't come at me. Apparently I can't see either, so. I can't read. I can't, uh, listen to. Explosions are awesome. Okay, bad again, I think. Metal plating for protection. Okay. Any specifics? Just cogs. Okay. Shorty fuse. There's a laser there. Goodness gracious. Alrighty. So there was one back here. Visible link? No. Uh, it's this one. Three plastic containers. Okay. Let's go talk to Sticky Woo. Cover an unsticking object. Cool. <clears throat> so that leaves us with three open tune tasks. Are there any other side tasks? Kissy monkey do. Let's go grab that one. Real quick. Then we can end stream. Um, and probably play some more of this on Thursday. So. Wow, 
wacky way. There we go. Let's head down this way. Where am I going here? All the way down, it looks like. Alrighty. Start running. <sighs> the building beside you is lying to you, the building next to you is telling the truth, something like that. Very funny. Something beside me is lying to you. Is that floating over that chair? <laughs> I don't think that sign is supposed to be floating over that chair. That's funny. It's just little things. It's great. Okay. And then this one is... No, the building beside me is telling the truth. So it's like, it's always lying, but it's, it's, it's you know, classic puzzle. Constantly truthful. Now I have to go back and see for them myself. Six steps. Time. Wait, what? What? Tell the truth? So conflicted. Clear wacky way of treasure's cogs. Okay. So when we um, start back up, we will probably start with these fighting cogs on wacky way. Um, but I think that it's going to do it for us on stream. I'm going to see if there's anybody that we want to raid real quick. My friends live. The people that I follow at least. That empty stream. Oh, that. Please stand by. people that I follow that are streaming are playing um like like horror games um so maybe not that um <laughs> so oh I fell asleep um I think we might just I just end stream here I'm gonna actually go back to the playground it'll spawn me at the playground but I'll do it. I'll do it anyway. So yeah. I will be back um, Thursday playing Toontown Corporate Clash. Um, we'll pick back up where we started. I won't be streaming uh, Friday because I already had a thing that I planned on before everything happened that I couldn't stream for like a month and a half. Um, but yeah. I will be back uh, Thursday at 10 a.m. Eastern Time playing some Toontown Corporate Clash. Um, but thank you so much for hanging out with me today. 
and bye bye